I told Ross, I was like, yeah, I'll come in and do the travel segment if you could play Kelly Clarkson since you've been gone. Oh, and she you. delivered. Ross delivered for us. So, uh, yeah, Kylie, this segment is wow. all about since you've been oh. gone. Here's you and Kelly Clarkson up on the screen over here. So we've missed you. And I was like, you've been gone, what, like a year? But it's only been like three months. Yeah, it goes by well, quickly. Well, we've missed you. It's been I've great to have you. David here, but um, we've missed you a lot. So I just wanted to get you caught up. You know, you've got Chloe and got a yes. lot of stuff going on at home. We have stuff going on here, too. So uh, I'll go through what Whitney and I have been through and uh, we'll talk oh, a little cool, bit about, okay. about uh, what it's like to travel with a newborn in case you're into that. So my life hasn't really changed months <laughs> since you've been gone. Uh, I still have Myrtle. Myrtle still doesn't like us. But Hi, um, here she is. She's still cute and she turns nine this week. So happy Aww. birthday to Myrtle. That's what I have going on. Whitney has um, been volunteering, I think, at a cat shelter, right? Quite a bit, yeah. And she has a number of new cats at home. Not all of these are hers, but she's been um, spending a lot of time with cats at the shelter. And she also has a new podcast. Have you listened to Beyond the Next Chapter with Whitney Clark yet? It's, it's on the like list. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's on the yeah. list, yeah. I listened to the episode with your dad. It was endearing. Thank I thought you. it was very Same sweet. Here. I love That's podcasts. Sweet. And like each episode, she brings a cat in to hang yeah. out on the table with her. In that the was smoky. Yeah, so that's a, a pretty cool idea, I thought. Uh, Ian is all over the place. He's been hanging out here on this show once in a while. Um, Yetta got a show. Ian showed up. Suzanne has a show. Ian's there. Jamie's got the podcast. Ian showed So Ian's like, you can't turn on this channel without Ian being on. And I was at a barbecue at his house last weekend. He's starting to read so he can be on your podcast next. Oh. So you can't get rid of Ian. The most incredible thing that happened since oh you've been God. gone is that Gibby celebrated 30 years at Arizona's family. Did you see Aww. this? This is pretty incredible. That's 30 awesome. years. Like that was like a jaw dropper for me. I loved it. So great to have Gibby with us for all those years. Um, okay. Uh, this is really about welcoming you back to uh, Good Morning Arizona, Kylie. So my question to you is, do you, do, do you want to travel or are you just happy to be home right now? You know, I do like to travel, so I would be up for a little trip, maybe, you know, summer. Because my okay. husband's like, let's go somewhere next month. I'm like, the weather's <laughs> nice. Let's go somewhere in the summer yeah. when we have a little baby and that's a good we want to get somewhere cool. Yeah, that's a good idea because people, when you bring like a baby on, on the plane, people kind of give you a look. Now, I give parents the benefit of the doubt because it's out of their control. You know, and sometimes they have to go visit uh, friends or relatives. And I don't oh know who wouldn't want to <laughs> oh sit on a plane next to this little oh angel gosh, there. What? Right? So I think I, I think that'd bring a smile to my face oh, if gosh. I was on a plane and, we did a and, and you were right next photo to me. Shoot. That yeah. was my mom was the photographer. Was very there. sweet. So it looks like she's ready to fly. I don't know. Um, so they actually did a survey. They asked a hundred moms what's the best age to fly with a baby. They asked a hundred moms, and uh, many of them said never with a baby. But oh, gosh. fifty-five percent said three to nine months. That way you've built up a little bit of immunity with the baby, or the vaccines are done at one point, and they're still sort of immobile by nine months. So between three and nine months, they say, is the best time to fly with the baby if you choose to do so, Kylie. Oh so I'm just goodness. like throwing that out there. That's the expert advice from other moms who've been there. Um, also, another great idea, this is my always, you know, you fall back on Sedona. That to me sounds like a great relaxing time to just uh, maybe take Chloe and your husband up to Sedona and just relax and stare at the Red Rocks for a couple days. And I thought this was actually pretty interesting. This is something we can all use, a piece of travel advice we can all use. I've ever been to this hotel. This is the Orchards Inn right in downtown Sedona. And what I like about it is each one has a balcony. So you stare off into the Red Rocks and it's uh, very pretty there. So I looked on all the different websites, oh. hotels.com, Travelocity, and I looked on their website. It's $189 a night. Okay, but then I looked under the specials in the offer section. They have a local offer, 25% off. So that 189 a night turned into 152 a night, which I thought was pretty good. And all of the web, all of the hotels up there do this. The Arabella offers 15% for a Zonies discount. The Amara, 25% for a regional offer. The Wild Resort and Spa, 30% off. So it is worth you guys. Oh, we don't have time for Las Vegas, but look at how expensive hotels are there. Wow. Yeah. Um, look, when you go to hotel website, it is definitely <laughs> worth going to their specific website, their offers and their specials, because you will often find local deals for local residents in Arizona. <gasps> Thank you, Jared. Okay.
I tried appreciate to squish that. a lot of stuff in there. Yeah. Ian took up too much time. <laughs> well, Ian is notorious for that. I remember the Super Bowl last year, like I had stories signed up <laughs> um, and planned, and he's like, hey, can I join you? He just likes camera yeah. time. He likes air time. And we if you're watching Ian. Ian we love Ian. Well, he's away this weekend, yeah. which is why I can gossip. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so no surprise that he's managed to be on yes. every show possible. Yeah. Welcome back. Thank well, you. I appreciate it. I'll be asking you for tips on anytime, uh, anytime. traveling with the newborn, although you've never traveled with the newborn, but no. you've been around a lot of babies on flights. Many. Yeah. That was so cute. That was really cute. It. You and Chloe were enjoying that flight. Yes. You had the whole row to yourselves. <laughs>